Those look like they were at one point actually jeans. Uh, did you self fashion them or did you? <laughs> I did. Welcome, yeah. <laughs> welcome to LA, bro. Yeah. <laughs> self. Yes, I self fashioned them. No, you can tell because they're it's because that's not only has it got the little fraying action, but they're mm -hmm. usually tighter around the top of the legs. Because I did that one time and I looked like. <laughs> I was belonged on a porch uh, on a porch swing <laughs> with another gay man. Now tell us your gene policy. Yeah. What, uh, <laughs> well, the listeners can't tell this, but uh, there's no back to these. Uh, it's just a thong. <laughs> yeah. <in the> back. <laughs> <laughs> it's the it's like a jean apron. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's just in the front. You I, cook that way. I actually I, I went to this. Uh, I used to go to this, this uh, church camp actually uh, back in the day. I grew up like super religious household. No shit. And, what what religion? Yeah. Uh, like Protestant Christian. Gross. Yeah. No. <laughs> <laughs> he was barfing a bucket. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, <laughs> speaking of um, gene thongs, uh, one of the things that I did uh, that I thought was hilarious because it was super edgy at the time is uh, it was this tradition that every year that I would go to this uh, church camp, I would cut a pair of jean shorts they look like jean shorts in the front that were already like they look like booty shorts so people are like huh it's a straight guy wearing short shorts this is ridiculous <laughs> <laughs> irony <laughs> yeah <laughs> But then I would turn around and there's no back. It was just the strip of jean. This is a real thing. This is a real thing. This is a real thing. I didn't even know we were going to talk about this. Yes. Okay. Welcome to the podcast. Yeah. yeah, exactly. No, this is based on a true story. And uh, and people at the you know the other kids at this church camp would freak out when you know when I turn around they're like this is the craziest thing I've ever seen because <laughs> they're not used to seeing flesh or anything like yeah, that yeah. and I'm like what's the most edgy thing I can do at this camp? A little side note at this camp we couldn't wear shorts you had to wear pants as as males no and, shit it was uh -huh. like stand up comedy the camp yeah no exactly <laughs> <laughs> not around the altar you're not yeah, allowed yeah. to wear shorts or anything and the women had to wear uh dresses past the knee oh wow. and whenever they uh wore uh played sports they were allowed to wear what's called culottes uh which are these basically <laughs> it's my favorite drink from dunkin donuts right <laughs> culottes my favorite sort of yeah. episode I've ever had in my life. It sounds like the movie The Village, is I what it know. sounds like. I mean, you definitely some elements <laughs> for that, for sure. Culottes are basically, uh, they're kind of like women's shorts. Uh, they look like a skirt, but there's like this seam in the middle, but there's like these giant like pant legs, basically. They're like parachute shorts, basically. <laughs> okay. Nice. So they were allowed to wear that. but uh, And also, you're, uh, you're supposed to wear T-shirts down to... The elbow, wow. which is there is that's nothing, a hard. There's style. nothing sexier than an elbow. In yeah, fairness. I know, like, dude. That could really get some dude, people I going. Was checking out these girls' <laughs> elbows, and like, I was, I was putting it up in the spank bank for later, yeah. dude. And uh, dude, I got quite the catalog. Now. Yeah. <laughs> so moisturized. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> the jean thong, basically, one of the uh, the uh, the counselors. Uh, he came in and I was wearing it and dancing around the barracks and stuff like that. <laughs> Your dick tucked under. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, barely behind the flap of denim yeah. in the shorts, and uh, they thought that they were going to uh, uh, try to embarrass me. And they stole the jean shorts whenever I was in the shower. And uh, the next morning, they had them up on the flagpole in front of everybody. Oh my god! <laughs> That's like Angus. Oh yeah, I know. <laughs> But with a jean thong, they tried to publicly short. shame you. Yeah, yeah, and I and they're like, uh, they're like, does anybody want to claim these? And I was like, yeah, those are mine. <laughs> and it, they, they, it completely backfired on them because I just owned up to. It. I was like, yeah, those are me. And they're like, um, it made them look creepy. Yeah, yeah of course that they stole my like. <laughs> what a fucking bizarre move! What harlot owns yeah. this yeah. thong jean? Yeah, exactly. That's when you want to make your Irish goodbye.